Hello YouTube, King Duke 91 here, back with some more Pokemon Snake Woods. So, I took a little bit of break and did a tiny little bit of training. I got Puchiana up, I think, two levels. He wasn't, he was a little bit more difficult to train, so I kind of stopped. He's level five now. And then in the meantime, I caught this little guy, Dot, who I promptly nicknamed Nutcase. Um, so yeah, he's, um, he, he, he'll need some training in the future, but yeah, he, he might not be a part of the team, but you know, a, um, a fucking shift tree would be nice. So I'll need a leaf stone at some point. I think that's how you get a shift tree. And then we got Baltoy up to level 12. Who... We're gonna need a Talo as well later on. Because of the fucking... Quote-unquote gym leader that's coming up. But uh, for now I got Bal uh, Baltoy up to level 12. Right, he also learned a new move. He learned... While we were training, he learned Psybeam. So yeah, this little dude's a lot stronger now. So yeah. But um, we're going to continue on the way over to Petalburg City. And um, beat the trainers that are just outside here. Not really trainers so much as zombies, but yeah. This one, she, this lady is the reason why I trained, actually. She's got like a level t 11, I think? Yeah, she has a level 11 Rotmander. Oh, it's level 9, not 11, my bad. Still, this is the reason why I train, because this guy can hit like a truck at level 9, so, yeah. And Growl doesn't affect us because we're using a special attack, so, yeah. And that's a dead Rotmander. Awesome. And that's Ghost Girl Janice defeated. Bahaga, the zombie crumbled, crumbled into dust. I don't know why it says zombie when she was a ghost girl, but yeah. Ka, another zombie over here. Oh, you've got different music, dude. Zombie kid at Allen sent out a boil basaur. This dude has got Team Magma Aqua music. Let's kill this boil basaur with a confusion. Doesn't really stand a chance. To experience points and another boil basaur. Alrighty then. I was hoping you might have had a shrivel sore. Spoiler alert, that's the evolved form of boil basaur. Awesome. Halfway to level 13. Maga. 96 poke dollars. Blurg. The zombie crumbled into dust. So, there's a nice little thing here. This. A medical kit. Wounds of all all the Pokemon are completely healed. So it's a port it's basically a portable um Pokemon Center without the anima Pokemon Center animation, so yeah. You lady, let's fight. Fleesh. Oh no, she's saying flash. My bad. Not fleesh. Ghost Girl Danny. And Oozle. Right, this is the squirrel counterpart. This one can hurt. So yeah, side beam. God damn that defense. That was a crit? Oh, okay. Never mind, I guess he can't hurt. Ah. Let's kill him with a rapid spin. Awesome. Foe Oozle fainted. Now I gained 75 experience points. Player defeated Ghost Girl Danny. Girk. $196. Rah! And she's crumbled into dust. So we're going to go over in here. This is a little bit morbid. So yeah. This woman appears to have had, to have had her legs gnawed off, which accounts for why her corpse is still on this chair. Will you loot her corpse? Yes. Obtain the leftovers. So yeah. We're about to give our Pokemon flesh. There you go, Balto. I have some flesh. So yeah, a little bit morbid. A medical kit. Heal up. Alrighty. And then of course we can't go in here. It's possible and enter the doors are firmly wedged shut by a mess of skulls and stuff. You're you're Chris? How'd you know that? You look like your brother. Are you going after him? 
Yeah. Then will we bring peace and put the dead back in their graves? Yeah, sure, why not? I believe you. Your brother and his girlfriend were headed into Petalburg Woods when they passed through here. Now please, go and... They're here! Quick, run for it. I'll hold them off as long as I can. Grah! I said run, Chris. Don't worry about me. Rah! And if you go back, he's promptly gone. Say he's just dead. So, I'm going to grind something out. What? Okay, that might be why the game had crashed. <laughs> We're going to make a save here, just in case it does. But, I'm going to do something while I pause the recording. You guys will have to excuse me for a little bit. I will be back after I've promptly got, because, a shit ton of these. Now, the reason why I say that is because you can constantly loot these. So, yeah. I'll be back in a little bit. Alright, we're just grabbing a couple more now. Awesome. So, I think that's enough. <laughs> we're gonna move these up here. Get my OCD and all sorted out and everything. And then... Awesome. So, 80 light potions should be enough to last us a while. <laughs> um, not really, actually. I'm going to act... Believe it or not, I'm going to need them. This is incredibly difficult. Glur the zombie looks kind of ill and seems disinclined to attack. Perhaps it's the salty sea air. Which, yes, it is. Hello, good sir. No, these are my items. And this guy's a looter. Looter Lawrence would like to battle. He has a sea dot, which I have one of as well. Talo. We need one of these, by the way. All right. I've lost everything. The zombies that my family destroyed my home and what little we I had left was stolen by looters. Poor girl. Very, very... This game is very, very morbid, but yeah. I'm gonna make a save here. I'm trying to extract some salt from the seawater. If a zombie tastes salt, it turns back into a corpse. Haitian legend says so. I don't believe that works. Honestly. I just tried to get Mr. Briney to take me to Duford because it's an island and zombies can't cross running water. But Mr. Briney tried to eat me. Good, Mr. Briney has become a zombie as well. I will defend my right to thieve to the death. There's another looter. Looter Richie would like to battle. He's got a surskit. Surskits are no joke, actually. These things can hit like a truck. That was a speed tie, and he was two levels below me. Or maybe just until I'm defeated. Huh. <sighs> Alright, so we're going to search here for Talo for a little bit. I really don't want a Wurmple, but I do want a Talo. I should probably actually do this really quickly as well. Get my health up. Come on, give me Talo. I know they're in here. Wow, come on, where's the Talo? Alright, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to pause this till I find a Talo, so I'll be back in a minute. Okay, finally found one after about two minutes of searching. God, this thing was a pain in the ass to find. Good lord. We're going to need this little guy, though. Because of the because of the place that's up next. Uh yes, yes, I get it. Okay, get in the ball. Thank you. Taylor's data was added to the Pokedex. Now we have a tiny swallow Pokemon. Taylor courageously stands his ground against foes, however strong they may be. 
This gutsy Pokemon will remain defiant even after loss. On the other hand, it cries loudly if it becomes hungry. So, what are we going to name this dude? Well, I have a good idea for a name. This is kind of silly. But, we're going to name him... We're going to name him Twitter. Because, silliness ho. Okay, we're going to run over here. Take a heal. Take a save. Awesome. I healed again. Whatever. Uh, we're going to go like this. We're going to switch Pokemon. We're going to put Twitter out front. Uh, I want to get this po this uh, in order a little bit. Modest nature. Alright. I think that raises special attack. He's got peck, so that's good. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to come over here. And, um... Well, I hate to do this to you, but you're going to join me on a grinding session. The grinding is going to take place in here because Tail is good against grass types. And these are bug Pokemon. So, yeah, we're going to grind out in here a little bit. We're not going to fight Zigzagoons, though. We will fight Wurmples and such, however. So, yeah... We need a higher level Talo anyways, because... Excuse me? Do you know how rare these are in Petalburg Woods? Do you know how rare Pikachus are to find in Petalburg Woods? This is like... That's Viridian Forest rare. Whenever Pikachu comes across something new, it blasts it with a jolt of electricity. I accidentally pressed B instead of A. My bad. That is fucking... Absolutely nuts. And he's got an adamant nature? Oh, that's not good. Because he's Pikachu's not a physical attacker, really. Uh, although he's got 11 attack now, so I mean, it's not bad, but yeah. That is incredibly rare to find one of those. Now there is actually a reason why we're uh, leveling up a sh a uh, this little dude in here. Okay, that was not, I was not doing, I wasn't paying attention. Alright, so, we're going to go back and heal this dude. God damn it. We're actually going to run this way because I don't want to run into the grass. But, um, yeah, we're going to need a tail because of the area coming up. There's a boss that has a level... Third, sort of a boss. It's more of a gym leader, but they have a level 13 Murkrow. And I don't want to get absolutely owned by it, so we're going to be doing some training in Pittleburg Woods, training this Talo up. I could train up the Pikachu, but... It wouldn't be good against Shroomish. I'd have to kill Wurmples, and those get, give less experience than Shroomish does, so... Yeah... Cascoon. Okay. Awesome. Learn quick attack. Okay, so I'm actually going to do something here. I'm going to take the leftovers from Baltoy and give it to Twitter. Because Twitter's going to be our main for a little bit. And the, uh, exper the, um, it'd be nice if he had it because, uh, god damn. Because he's going to be taking a little bit of a beating here.
You know, I, I don't want to kill Zigzagoons. They're not really worth the experience. Wormples, however, give lots of experience. I kind of want to get my Talo to have... Um, been, it, it would be incredibly nice if the Talo got um, Wing Attack by the time we got to go fight the thing. The Murkrow. So yeah, this is uh, this is what I was doing when I was grinding Baltoy up, except killing lower levels. Also, it was really easy to get those potions as well because the mashing was so fucking. Because I'm good at mashing buttons, as you can tell from the way I'm fighting these battles, that they're just kind of ending quickly. Wing attack, awesome. Get rid of Growl. Okay, so I'm actually also going to do do this again. I'm going to run back and heal. I don't care if we f if we run into any Pokemon in here. But I'm not done training Talo yet. We're not getting a Swellow before we fight that thing at all. But we are going to have a Talo. I'm, I'm going to go for level 16, actually. Because... Um, that's actually, like, a happy level for fighting that fucking Murkrow. Which, it fucks your day. It really does. It's not an easy Murkrow. Um, this Talo can actually come over here. We can come over and talk to this dude here. You! What's up, Larry? Um, what do you have? Super potions, antidote, water bottle, pokeballs, paralyzed heals. We'll get a paralyzed heal. Heals Pokemon of a burn. Nothing else. There's actually something in here, isn't there? Yeah, Super Potion. He's not very good at fighting. Or at looting, not fighting. You. I've been running from the zombies for days now, but they're everywhere. My Pokemon can barely carry on. Oh, you have a spare potion. Please, can I have it? Of course. It's all yours. Thank you so much. Literally, you've saved my life. Please take this small gift in exchange. And a Drin Helen. We're giving that to Talo. Also, I'm going to open this door because my room is incredibly hot again. I can barely keep that thing clo open, uh, closed for very long. So we're going to take the leftovers now from Talo. And uh, give him the Anadrin Talon. Because that powers up flying type moves. Another Pokeball. Awesome. Now, what a lot of people do is with the light potions, the supply crates, they usually farm them for hours on end. And sell them in exchange for Pokeballs, which I will admit is kind of smart, but... I don't want to do that. I'm not a cheap asshole. So, yeah. So we're going to go for level 16 with Talo. Uh, mm, yeah, we'll go for level 16 because I really, really... Good thing I have... Oh, antidotes. But yeah, I really, really want to be able to beat that Murkrow. Awesome. Two more levels. It's going swimmingly. It's also a good thing we picked up the Anadrin Talon, because that does make this a little bit faster as well. Also, if this was a Nuzlocke, that Twitter would be dead. There would be no saving him. Alright, one more level. Did not mean to... yeah. Alright, kill this Wormpole. We're very, very close now. We're about halfway there. In fact, you know what I'm going to do? I 
Forgot there was a trainer in here. You. No, you mustn't go on, man. There are things so powerful and terrifying. I can't let you throw your life away like this. This dude will level me up. He's got a slack off level 7. And I have four pecs. That'll take two to kill him. He does a decent amount of damage. That should be level. Yep. Level 16. Wormpole, no. You know something? I haven't changed the controls on the emulator at all. I just, by memory, remembered what, what they were. Select is backspace, enter is pause. Z and X is A and B. And the arrow keys are move. Which those are obvious, but yeah. J just by memory, I have that. I, I just remembered that. I love that. Because it, it's it's an automatic reaction. It's like, oh, well, these are these are move. This is this and this, 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 and this. It's really easy to forget things like that, but... It's an automatic reaction if you're able to remember. And it's, it's freaking cool. Just like WASD is is universal move uh, when you're playing a game. Whoa, the pain. Young one, your body looks in better shape than this decrepit one. I shall possess you instead. This is the gym leader. Levitating leg... Le uh, sorry, no. Demon Corpse Zabulon would like to battle. Demon Corpse Zabulon sent out Hound Sour. That's the first one. Wing attack. That's another reason why I changed, or why I leveled up. Oh my. Oh, that Anadrin Talon's good. Oh man, this Dust Crow, though, is going to hurt. Dirt Crow, sorry. This thing is going to hurt. It's a golden Murkrow. This thing hits like a freaking truck. Which is why I leveled up a lot. So I could do this much damage. Yeah. It's got lots of defense. Unfortunately. Oh shit. Here we go. This is gonna hurt. That didn't do as much damage as I thought it was going to do. That will do a lot. Or not. But we're going to heal to be on the safe side because I think she's going to heal as well. Nope, just use Peck. Alright. We win. If I was level 13, I would have lost Twitter. That's, the, that's how big of a difference three levels is. And a level up. So we're now we're level 17. Player defeated Demon Corpse Zabulon. Hack such strength! We demons may possess corpses, but we are honorable. You have defeated me, and so I shall warn you that stronger demons than I lurk ahead in the city you call Rustboro. The corpse crumbled into dust. The demon flitted back to the netherworld. What's this? Looted a stone badge from the dust of the corpse. This badge, it seems familiar. I think I remember something. I can feel a flashback coming on. This stone badge raises the attack of my Pokemon. I got it from Gym Leader Roxanne. Ugh, that flashback hurt my brain, but I remember where these come from. These gym badges, the gym leaders have them, and the gym leaders are strong. So what could possibly have happened to, the, to Rustboro that even the gym leader was defeated? I better investigate with extreme caution. Also, this place got extremely dark all of a sudden because of that. Which probably... I uh, use a Paralyze Heal on Twitter. I'm going to die. I can feel the poison chilling my blood and turning my brain to soup. Erg, dead. Rip. Oh, God damn it. I was wanting to get an item slack off. And we'll come up here, grab this. It's an ether. They're very, very handy. I was wanting to get an item, Shroomish. Thank you. Go away now. You. Hmm, a fresh, juicy body, right for the taking. 
Andromalius sent out secret egg. Wing attack. It has high defense of numbers. Yeah, that thing is really high defense. I even have uh, the Andr the talon on this on my tailo. Oh god, here we go. Here we go. Oh my god. <sighs> okay, you know what? I'm not dealing with this. We're going to speed this up. Thank god. Demon Corpse and Drum Andromalius. No, I've been driven out. Curses, you've banished me. The corpse turned to dust. The demon fled back to the netherworld. We're going to heal. Wait, 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 wait. That's what I thought. We're going to give you the leftovers. Money in this game, by the way, is absolutely no worry. And this is a severed head of a Pikachu, and it's been mounted on a stake. Loot this dead Pikachu? Yeah, why not? We'll take his super potion. Severed head of a P Oh, yeah, I already read that. Cherry berries, Oran berries. Let's go in here and take these items. Go away, Wingull. Can't remember where they all are. There we go, and there's nothing up here. Yeah. And in here is a Whalmer pail. Because this used to, you know, be the flower shop, and there's no one in here anymore. Excuse me, I like crack my fucking fingers and stuff. Oh my god. The way I have my hands on the keyboard is kind of weird. Hey, zombie! I'm not a zombie. I ain't no zombie. I ain't no zombie. Survivor Tilly would like to battle, and she sent out a Puchiana. Fuck. Okay, not Jaws, Twitter. Oh, that lucky crit, though. Oh, you're not a zombie. No, I'm not. I'm really not a zombie. Uh, what do you give me? If you're a trainer, then you can help us citizens of Rustboro. Go to the city and rid us of the demons. If it'll help, please take this TM-09. I can't remember what that is. Go on and help us, help save us all. What is TM-09? Grass Whistle. Now that is actually kind of cool. But, um, I'm gonna end this video here. Sorry to cut it short, but yeah. If you enjoyed, comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Let's get let us know what you guys like, and I'll see everyone in the next video. And this is, I'm dead serious about saying when this is going to be a finished series. I'm going to finish this. It may not be in this house, but it'll probably finish in the next house, because I am moving very soon. So, I may be gone offline on Steam for a while, or offline on YouTube and all that for a while, so yeah. Anyways, I'll see everyone later. King Duke and I to an up. Peace. Later, guys.